Good afternoon, I'm Katie Collette with your Wavy TV 10 headlines. After a big misstep, the lead detective in the search for Cody Bigsby has been replaced. Now legal experts are weighing in on how this could impact the case. Cody was reported missing January 31st. Police tell us his dad, Corey Bigsby, is a person of interest. Police Chief Mark Talbot said there was a mistake following a heated back and forth between Corey and the lead detective after a polygraph test. Corey made a statement about wanting legal counsel. The chief says it was not honored. Bigsby's defense attorney, Jeffrey Ambrose, says it is a substantial civil rights violation. Virginia Beach attorney Sonny Stallings tells us how this misstep could generally impact any case. Meanwhile, search teams independent of the Hampton Police Division will be in Ocean View today looking for Cody. Fire forced two families from their homes. Virginia Beach crews say the fire happened at an apartment building on Hubert Place near Diamond Springs Road around 9.30 last night. The battalion chief tells us no one was hurt. The property manager is helping the two displaced families. The cause of the fire was accidental. Parents may soon be able to opt out of sending their student to school with a mask on. If Governor Glenn Youngkin has his way, it could happen as early as next month. A bill allowing parents to opt out of a district's mask mandate has already passed in the State House and Senate. Yesterday, Governor Youngkin added an amendment to the bill and sent it back to lawmakers. It would allow the bill to go into effect March 1st. It needs to pass the State Senate and House with a simple majority. It's not clear yet when a vote will happen, but it is expected to pass. You can find all of your headlines and your Super Doppler 10 forecast throughout the day on wavy.com. Have a great day.